Hello, it's your boy, John Z. Who the fuck is John Z? Today, I'm going to be showing you how to set up LR2 HD. LR2 is a pain in the ass to fucking set up. But after these five simple steps, five simple, oh, so simple, wow. You should be able to run the game in HD and online. These steps worked for me, and there may be a better way of doing this, but this way should work, so... Uh, be sure to read the LR2 Reddit page if you need uh, further help. Um, it's a great tutorial page for setting up this this uh, this really good program. It's so good. Wow. Um, and of course, if you have any questions, just comment and I'll try to help out. All links will be in the description below and in steps for your fucking convenience, you bitch. Um, but yeah, all right. Let's get right into it. All right, step one, changing your locale to Japanese. First thing you're going to want to do is change your system locale uh, to Japanese. I'm using Windows 7, so setting up may be a little different for you, but should be similar. Uh, first thing you're going to want to do is go to uh, Start Control Panel. Uh, head over to Clock, Language, and Region. Go to region and language. Uh, this should pop up. Head over to administrative, the administrative tab, and click on change system locale. You're going to want to change it to Japanese. Um, you may have to restart after this. If you do, that's fine. Just go ahead and restart, and that should take care of step one. All right, step number two. This one is really hard. Make sure you get WinRAR. That's it. That's that's step number two. Um, we'll be using WinRAR a lot in this tutorial, so if you don't have it, make sure you grab that shit and download it for your system. And that's it. That's step two. LOL. All right, step three. This is where shit is really going to get TMF. Um, this is where we're going to download LR2 itself. The link will be in the description. Um, <clears throat> once downloaded, extract it to wherever you like. I'll be putting it on my desktop for the purposes of this tutorial. Uh, once extracted, open your LR2 folder and uh, open LR2 EXE. Some Japanese text will show up. Just click OK. Um, next, you're going to want to enter your LR2 ID and password here. Um, just make up an LR2 ID and password name it whatever you want I'll be uh, big tit 707 and just make up a password click OK <clears throat> and this should show up just click OK all right after you've uh, set up a name and a password uh, should look like this um, make sure window mode is uh, checked go to system click OK Make sure wait for vsync is checked. Um, we need to spart, spart. We need to start the program at least once for our next step. In order to do this, we need some BMS files. I've provided a link with the test BMS. It's a Chrono Trigger song. Lol. Be sure to download it and dump it into your LR2 Beta 3 root folder. Um, next, you're going to want to go to Jukebox 1. Click OK. And you're gonna you're gonna want to add this test, basically BMS folder. So look for it. LR2 beta 3 test. Click OK. Click yes. Um, once added, go ahead and run the program. Just click play. Yeah, it's whatever. Um, this box should show up. Just hit any key. Yeah, ready, whatever. And there. It, wow, there it is. That's it. Wow. All right, just uh, exit out of the program. That's all we needed to do. Um, but yeah, just exit out, and that's it. On to step four. All right, step four, setting up LR2 HD itself. Next, you're going to want to grab LR2 HD. There's a link in the description, of course. Um, download it. Open it with uh, WinRAR. Extract the contents. Uh, let me get it for you right here. Here we go. Um, go into your LR2 HD folder, you'll see this, just grab it all, extract it, 
or dump it into your LR2 Beta 3 folder. Your folder should now look like this. We need to head over to our config folder. Go into your LR2 uh, files folder. Head over to your config folder. Uh, your config folder or your config file should be in here. Uh, remember, you have to run the program at least once for this to show up. So um, we need to change config.xml to config.xmh by renaming it. Um, unless you can already just name file types like this, you probably can't. You're going to want to do this if you can't. Uh, head over to start control panel. Uh, you're going to want to click on appearance and personalization. You're going to want to click on folder options. It should bring you up to this. Click on view and go to hide extensions for known file types. Uncheck it. Make sure it's unchecked. Click apply, click OK, and then get on out of that. Um, go back to config.xml. You're going to want to rename this to config xmh hit enter i will ask if you're sure yes just click yes all right um <clears throat> after that let's go back to our lr2 beta 3 root folder click on lr2 hd.exe this time this is what you're going to want to run on from here on out click run um here you're going to want to change your window size to 1280 by 720 uh, you'll be leaving it like this from here on out. Unless you just uncheck windowed mode, it'll be 720, but yes. Um, after that, uh, click on play. Yeah, click run. You can also uncheck that so you don't have to deal with that bullshit anymore. Um, and then run the program. Should look like this now. So if you saw, the program looks a little janky right now. I mean, it's a janky program. What can I say? It's supposed to look like that. Um, let's move on to the last step, getting an LR2 HD theme. All right, so the last step you're going to want to do is uh, get an HD theme. Uh, I personally prefer the WMIX uh, skin, but uh, there's other skins out there. Just Google is your friend. Just check. Uh, I did provide a link for the WMIX skin. Uh, in the description, of course. Um, but uh, yeah, grab the skin and download it in the link below. Um, the WMIX skin should be right here um, under LR2 files. You can just dump it in here and let it override. But personally, I like to go into the actual theme. So you'll want to go into LR2 files theme and just dump it right up in here just put it in here extract it or dump it in there whatever and that's fine um, there's also a fix for this uh, this skin we're gonna want to grab that as well uh, let me go ahead and grab that real quick okay so here's the fix um, just go in here grab all this shit dump it in there override yeah yes it's all good move and replace it's all good um all right get on out of that all right now let's head back to lr2 hd run the program again um hit play yes whatever um next we're gonna actually pick the this steam for your game. all right you're going to want to go to System Options right here and click on Skin Slash Sound. You're going to want to go here. Um, this is where you can customize all your shit. Be careful. The game crashes frequently in this page. Just be slow. This program is 2 out of 5. Lol. Alright, so in 7 keys, you're going to want to just click basically this right arrow. Click it until you see this this is fine um it looks a little janked up of course as well you can also uh customize it down here whatever whatever you like it's all good 
Let's move over to music select. Uh, do the same thing. Just move it over. There it is. You can, uh, you know, once again, change whatever your settings, whatever you like. Go to decide. Do the same thing. Change it to W mix decide. There's a couple of options here. And result. Change it again to W mix result HD. You can also change your shit here. Uh, go ahead and right click. Right clicking basically uh, backs out of the pro, or basically just backs out. It's kind of like a, yeah, just back out, whatever. There you go. There you go. Let me lower this shit. So there's, uh, there it is. Should work. Um, you may have to fuck with the settings a bit. Um, oh. Wow. Um, but yeah, hopefully it works. This should run the program. I'm going to put a... Uh, oh, wow. Oh! Wow, Chrono Trigger. Oh, boy. Great. <laughs> Alright, anyway. <clears throat> oh, also as a, as a final kind of step. If you want to play online, uh, make sure you check this. If you have Rivals... This is for rivals and ranking. I personally just check all of this. I don't know. That's just me, though. But I think you really only need to check this if you want to play online. Um, you do have to play some songs to be into the system, the online system. So, And you can also uh, click right here to check your personal page and look for rivals and whatnot. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Uh, this is going to actually be a two-part tutorial. The next part will be setting up, like, the skin and what you can do and all that stuff. Really, I just wanted to get the basics down, get the program going. It's kind of a bitch to set up, but if you follow these steps, it should be good. Um, thanks for listening and watching. And remember, if you have any questions or if something's fucked up, just comment and I'll try to help you out. Um... And yeah, all right, I'll see you guys, I'll see you on Twitch, lol, night, night, later.